What's up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. I'm David Carroll, your Las Vegas realtor with Signature Real Estate Group, and we're back here again at Pinnacle Homes in the northwest of Las Vegas. These are luxury single-story homes, half-acre lots, RV parking, casita, and multi-gen options. They have three collections coming online late 2021. I'm also going to put a link down below and some more information about where their location is. And today we're going to be featuring the Contour model, 4,260 square feet. It's a four to five bedroom with the multi-gen. Let's take a closer look. You will get paver stone driveways included. Beautiful modern exteriors, modern elevation. If you're looking for that single story ranch with a large lot, this is the one. You do have spray on stucco and look at those long eaves. More stuccoed eaves under the garage door. Beautiful modern eight foot. These doors are long too. I wish I could show you the garages today. They got them currently locked. Now here on the contour, you do have this outdoor courtyard with the aluminum gate. And here she is. More stuccoed eaves, LED lighting, such a beautiful architecture, so contemporary. And this is part of that multi-gen. Look at all the windows. Now, one thing Pinnacle does different is they really add the lighting, the windows to make their homes light up, like just like that one there. You got 14 foot ceilings, 12 foot ceilings, 10 foot ceilings. This is the contour. You got your multi-gen access here. I just want to show you around this courtyard just one more second. She's a beauty, getting some great light. It is warming up a little bit. Let's head inside. Now, welcome to the contour. So open. Where do we start? Look at that header beam. Oh my goodness so tiled up beautifully you got this extended 16 foot triple glass slider isn't that gorgeous so we're looking at 14 foot ceilings over the great room multiple leds i just have to take a closer look at this feature wall these dark tiles get me every time you got the floating shelves cooking with gas I love these homes. Before coming out of here, I was literally thinking, how can I come up with a down payment for one of these? Because I want that casita. Welcome to your kitchen. Now behind this kitchen has this beautiful prep area. Got this oversized dark quartz top with the waterfall edge. Nice skin on the rear. Take a look at this quartz. Even got the black accents. Slide over to the sink. We've got some modern hardware. Apron edge farm style sink. Mowing style, but look at this. Beautiful. Let's head inside. Now I do want to show you here. Take a look at the cabinetry. This is that European style, the modern. Got your trash can upgrade right beside, and that's some solid wood. These are solid doors. Take a look at this cabinetry. You got the full dovetail undermount glide. Now here on this side of the kitchen, we got the 42 inch modern crown, nice flat crown. Got dual built-in ovens and cabinetry for days. Got the LEDs, got the cooktop. Look at that, Thermador style. I like Thermador, top of the line. Thermador, Wolf, Vulcan. Now we're cooking with gas. Beautiful Thermador vent hood, and she is venting out. Now on this side, we've got our built-in fridge, more storage, more LEDs. You got the microwave at a decent height, which you, you, know, you don't have to bend down to get it. You got it right here. Now right behind, you got your wine closet and your prep kitchen. Look at this, more storage, floating cabinetry. Beautiful backsplash. More of that upgraded hardware, that mowing. She is something else. Love that window above, so good. And here it is. I like the way this um, pantry is set up. It's kind of open air to the kitchen, so it gives it a crazy feel. 
and you got that modern window above. This is the pantry. And have you ever seen this before? I, I used to work in a hotel many years ago and we'd bake cookies in the morning with that one. Now if we just swing around the kitchen side, you do have a dining room in the rear, multiple LEDs, chandelier lighting, and it's all about these windows. Got a very nice wallpaper as well. Now let's take a look outside. You got this heavy modern all aluminum triple glass stacking slider. These aren't pocket doors, but these are a beautiful slide and they will slide all the way to one glass. And as we come out back, we've got some nice concrete work out here. Got your covered patio, six recessed lights and a pre-wire. How about that? Now this lot isn't as large as the half acre one next door, but it's pretty close. And they've got it decked out. Pebble Tech pool stonework for days. One thing I like about these, these pools is how you can do this island setup right here. I can see myself just floundering around all day in that. This also has the pop-ups for the self-cleaning. Got another island here. Here on the hot tub, it's got the infinity edge. Waterfall. I just like that, it's so clean. Look how close that water gets up. And on this side, you've got your lounge area. Got the stuccoed wall divider with the top. I like it. Now I want to show you here around the side, you do have RV parking. You got a 10 foot gate here and a nice little setup for all your pool equipment hidden behind. Great size home. I like the waterfall touches on that pool. If I had to guess on this pool, I'm going to say 150,000 for this backyard. Throw me a guess down in the comments below. Would love to hear what you think. You know, the more brick and the more pavers and then you got your upgraded pool from head to toe. She's a beauty. Now let's take a quick peek around the side here. I just love that casita on the aspect model. Now again, you can do these casitas on any uh, home site as long as it fits. They're running about 100,000 roughly. Got two high efficiency Lennox and look at all the windows with pinnacle homes stuccoed eaves, outdoor lighting, more of the palm trees. Again, I'm going to ask you one more time, what do you think about those palm trees? Now, build time from contract with Pinnacles about seven months. They got the three communities coming up in about September, October, late 2021. Now, right in the front, you've got your flex space, your front formal, turn this into an office. What would you do? Large windows. I want to point out this modern lighting too on the entry here in the foyer. Now what do we got here? Do we have a coat closet? We sure do. And here's all the options for the pinnacle. I'm not sure if you can read that. Maybe just pause it. All right, now let's flip it around. Let's find that primary suite. This is access around the corner to the multi-gen and we're coming there next. That is the star of this show. Now, welcome to the primary. So large. Got a six pack of LEDs. You got the skip trawl texture on the ceiling. That's an expensive one. Love in these windows that brings in all that natural light and really just gives you that energy to get your day started. And how about that view? I, I would not get, you know, I would probably get, it would probably get old swimming in the pool. Sometimes, you know, you don't want to swim, but looking at that pool will never get old. Stack stone feature wall all beside your bed. Look at that. Got these beautiful wood planks, all real wood. And here's the owner's bath. Welcome home. So large. I'm just going to back it up so you can see this. Got its own platform for the tub. Large single soaking tub. It's got the modern hardware, the wand. Look at those windows. I like how they put a square and a rectangle, just break it up, show you that beautiful architecture. And here is my favorite, half inch glass. 
It's got the modern window. Now take a look at the setup on this one. Do, do any of you guys have this type of setup with the Moen? I know there's a few different styles they've, they've been uh, doing lately. And it's got the waterfall. Fully loaded and here is your controls for the Moen. I like the dark gray tiles in my showers. Definitely gives it a higher end feel. You got nice dark gray luxury tiles all on the floor, floating vanities. Let's take a closer look. It's even got tile down below. LEDs, got your powder in the center. Beautiful cabinetry with the soft clothes. Now here on the extended vanity, got quartz, basin sinks. They pulled this blue tile, this aqua all the way around. Gives it a really cool feel. Side lighting. Now here on the side we have our linen. Modern hardware as well. Wouldn't expect anything less with these pinnacles. And here's your his and her closets. So this must be hers. Wow, it's even got the little walk-in. Hang your coats. Currently they have all their audio video. And then right next door, here's closet number two. And it's got the shoe rack. And here's a water closet. Well, what do you think about this bath? Has a pretty good feel to it. All right, now we're heading out of the primary suite. Here's access to the multi-gen. And look at this washroom, fully involved, fully upgraded, floating shelves. This thing's decked out from top to bottom. Washer and dryer are not included. And just look at that. Such a long island. Even got the backsplash on the wall. Now here we're coming into the next gen suite. Here's a full bath. Upgraded in the shower as well, quarter inch glass, tiles from floor to ceiling. They're going with all this black quartz on this model. And look at this shallow undermount. Can you see that? It looks like about a four inch depth. Pretty interesting. Even got the shorty mowing. Almost there. Here's the closet to the multi-gen. And if I flip it around, here is the suite to the multi-gen. 10 foot ceilings, four LEDs. This one has a slide in closet. Now here it is, here's the multi-gen living room and it is a beast. You've got the eight foot slide, modern windows all around. So you got one, two, three in the kitchen side, three on this wall and on your entrance door. I like it already. So you got two, uh, two recess over the dining. More of that quartz top. Backsplash upgraded. Look at that. Got your Whirlpool fridge built in here. Microwave by Thermador. And a full size sink. Now, one thing you can do, so you got the sink, you got the dishwasher. All you really need is like to put a little electric cooktop and you got a full kitchen, right? This does come equipped with a 42 inch modern crown cabinetry. This is a sweet for sure. I love that. This, this suite is bigger than my first apartment that I rented when I was 17. <laughs> oh my goodness, how times have changed. You do have access to the other two car garage as well, right through the next gen. So that is just perfect. Now here on the outdoor suite, we do have an aluminum slide. Oh, they got it locked. So I won't head out there, but it is nice and upgraded outside. It does have spray on stucco. Nice little courtyard area just to relax off of your multi-gen. I mean, you really have it all in here. You have your backyard. You can just swing around, jump in the pool. And all we need is family. All right, so that's our multi-gen suite option. 
So that's one thing really cool, but you got ranch homes, you got RV gates, you got the casita option, you got the multi-gen option. Again, pricing is to be determined soon. September, October, late 2021 build outs. Call me so we can get you on the interest list. Beautiful linen closet. The single story ranch has got to be a popular item right now. Before we show you, I show you these secondaries, we do have a restroom here to the side. And it's got the floating vanity, and I love how they just put the tile down below and then pull it all the way up. Chandelier lighting with the black, are those black tiles? Very nice guest bath. Now since that's the guest bath, here is the shared bath with the full bathroom. And look at this sink. It's got the modern drain to it. Just nice flat edge, can you see that? Backsplash all around, modern cabinetry. So they went with the white and the white quartz. It's got the tub and shower combo. Upgraded as well. Nice square tub. Oh, here's bedroom number three. So this one does have the extended three door slide in. Nice large single window. Got your RV gate right out the side. It's a beautiful day. We're out here in the northwest of Las Vegas, kind of like Ann and Conquistador, getting close to the 215. It's a beautiful area out here because a lot of the lots are like larger home sites. Feels a, it feel, the traffic is light out here. Something about this area. If you've never been to the northwest, it's definitely something to check out. Now swing through and look at this bedroom here. Bedroom number four. And it says the beach is calling and I must go. There's no beaches here in the desert, but I tell you what, this is a short drive. Now right outside of the rooms, you do have access to the secondary two car garage. So a total of four car garage on this home. Well, what do you guys think? This is Pinnacle Homes 2021. Three new communities coming online. Again, a total of nine lots, eight lots, and 17 lots. So it's, these are not big communities, but you get that half acre garage. If you like any more information, call me anytime. And if you like the video, hit like, hit subscribe, and we'll see you on the next one. Thanks for watching.